Hello everyone, I'm Luke Mertz and today I'm going to talk about views in Autodesk Inventor assemblies. We can find the views in the browser at the representations folder and with views we can not only set a camera position, we can also set the visibility of components, transparency, visibility of sketches, visibility of work planes, for example, uh, axes and, and points, work features in general, and we can configure an override color between views. This is very useful when we are working with big assemblies where we need to concentrate on specific components. So we can simply uh, right click the components that we want and do an isolate but if i need to get back to this isolate in the future i know that will be very useful to create a view so just click view right click view create a new view and that's it with this i'm done i can go to other views and then get back and i'm with the components that i selected we can also add components to this view, of course, by just uh, turning the visibility on on the browser of the components that we want, or we can also use the edit view option. With this, we are going to see the rest of the components that are not visible for us in this view, and then just uh, click them uh, we can choose them by uh, part priority or component priority. Right click, OK, and there we are with the new view, with the new components included on our view. OK, so what happened with the camera position? Actually, I have a different position from what it was at the beginning when I uh, turn it on this view. If I move to another uh, view and then get back, I'm going to stay at the same view that I was on. But if I need this position always, when I, when I go to, to this view, we can lock the view like this. And with this, we can rotate turn off visibility of components, move to another view, and then when we're back to the view, we are exactly on the same camera position with the same components and colors and everything. Thank you so much for your attention. Have a nice day. Bye.